what is going on hope you guys are doing extremely well today we're going to talk about why you should have these specific cryptocurrencies in your portfolio and what is the true value of investing in these specific cryptocurrency projects now many of us get into portfolios and they start building these portfolios and we start plugging in cryptocurrency projects that we really don't put too much mind to of how much uh, in-depth details we have to look at these projects and have to understand what specific needs we're looking for to make sure that we're investing in a very profitable cryptocurrency project so what i'm going to do is uncover some of these details for you so you have that understanding of why you need to look at specific details when it comes to investing in a cryptocurrency project So if you're willing, if you really want to put uh, some more uh, investment in yourself and learn more about cryptocurrency, I have my Patreon link. It's in the description. Make sure you guys check that out <clears throat> to give yourself uh, a quick understanding of uh, what it is to invest in cryptocurrency. Look at some strategic uh, planning that I put together while uh, it's geared towards how to choose specific cryptocurrency projects to make your portfolio be very successful also i have some trading call signals and a big community of investors who are like-minded and are willing to share information and give whatever knowledge that they have so that you guys could gain and retain some of that information so if you guys are interested check it out in the link the link is in the description it's under the 10x your crypto mindset because essentially we'll my focus is is to turn you into a 10x dominator at minimum all right so check out the link in the description so before we get into these cryptocurrency projects what i really want to do is give you the information that is mostly important um, on the front end of understanding cryptocurrency and understanding how to invest in these specific projects so mainly the main thing that you want to do is find the problem that we have today in the world how can we find a project that can relate to us as needing in the world what type of utility do these projects have that could actually provide us with some long-term utility we're not looking for the short term we're not looking for the best blockchain or fast transactions or fast speeds i get it those are qualities that we want in a cryptocurrency project but the ultimately what we're looking for is to understand how valuable these are for us in the future and what problem do they solve with web3 with blockchain technology with cross-border payments with cbdc's with metaverse with anything that's actually going to bring us some value add in the future so that's what's very specific when choosing a cryptocurrency project is understanding what is this project going to bring us well once you discover that that's just the first part of it that's the front load that's what you want to say okay well this is a check mark for this project to be able to start taking a deep dive and then we're looking into the blockchain is it a fast you know does it do fast transactions is a blockchain built to have a lot of security is a blockchain built with a roll-up or is it a hyperledger is it overledger is it a you know is it a proof of work proof of stake you know proof of unique stake uh you know what type of system is it built that is very critical so let's get into understanding now that we understand that <clears throat> this project or any specific projects have some utility and there's some use case and we could use it in the future we're going to start looking into some other information so let's get into what that other information looks like so the second most important thing when investing in cryptocurrency projects is understanding their blockchain, understanding their tokenomics, and understanding their roadmap. So these three, these are the next three things that you want to be able to make sure that you have a clear understanding of what these items correlate with that project. So we look at tokenomics. Well, the main focus on tokenomics is, is the project deflationary? meaning is it have a does it have a cap on the circulating supply and will that 
pre with a deflationary token what happens is is that once this goes into the market the cryptocurrencies start to go down and what it does is create a scarcity right because now you have demand for a certain amount of cryptocurrencies that's a deflationary type of token where the supply doesn't it doesn't allow for the supply to be added to it stays at a specific cap and that's where it's going to stay period inflation inflationary cryptocurrency tokens that mean it means that they're going to put out a certain amount of market cap or they're going to cap the uh, total supply but there's an infinite supply behind that so this is where it gets tricky when investing in cryptocurrency projects that are not capped out and they are inflationary tokens so that gives them the ability to drop tokens into the liquidity pool or essentially the circulation the supply circulating supply right i call it liquidity pool because you're adding more money well it's not essentially adding more money you're adding more product and less demand right so you're increasing product but the demand is is scarce right so it flip-flops so now you have a scarce demand with a maximum supply so those are tricky but <clears throat> that's where it comes into understanding the tokenomics part of it like how are these uh coins allocated what is their plan um, with these allocated coins like so essentially they could have a certain amount locked up for certain certain different things which actually kind of cuts the supply so it gets tricky like i said you really got to go in deep and deep and understand exactly what the tokenomic side of things are um so yeah so what you i mean what interests me is generally deflationary that have uh, a max supply that's it because i know that over time it's going to create scarcity and the demand for the token is going to be increased i'm always looking for increased demand with less product because that's where the value comes in into that project um roadmaps roadmaps are very important why are roadmaps important because you want to understand is that project moving forward or is it staying stagnant right so if you look at a project and you go to their roadmap and you see that uh, q1 through uh, quarter one of 2023 uh, and into quarter four of 2023 there's really not much going on they haven't met no milestones in the project that's a red flag you don't really want to get into a project that's not actually moving forward you're looking for projects that are moving forward they're doing things even if it's the bare minimum but they're continuing to move forward like they're gaining partnerships they're they're setting themselves up for success these are key items that you want to look at when it comes to researching a project you want to make sure that they're doing something that's going to benefit them any any way shape or form in the future that's what gives you a solid project and understanding that hey the roadmap is going along they're trucking along they're doing things they're checking out boxes they're meeting milestones this makes a valuable cryptocurrency project developers this is like one of the key things that i look for too is that i want to know who the developers are of this cryptocurrency project and why is it important because generally successful cryptocurrency projects have very high level uh, leadership teams behind them their senior leadership teams should have executives in there that have a solid background and i want to see what that background is because if i can't see who that person is what their background is and where they come from are they a developer or are they a code writer what do they do what do they contribute to this project gives me a clear understanding because if it's joe blow that just made a cryptocurrency out of his garage you know didn't get it verified or anything you know maybe they he had enough money to do a certic audit who knows he must he could be a rich kid with a lot of money that has no intentions to building a successful cryptocurrency project he just wanted to create he or she <clears throat> just wanted to create a cryptocurrency project and guess what now you got a rug pool or now you got a honey pot so these things are very very uh, critical to research when looking at cryptocurrency projects lastly what you want to look at is when you're going to actually invest what are you going to invest in this project well this is where you have to understand what level of cryptocurrency that you're investing in is it going to be a more of a, a high market cap cryptocurrency or is it going to be a mid cap or is it going to be one of the micro caps that you're going to take a, a gamble on you know a lot of times <clears throat> these gambles could be extremely successful if you know how to pick the cream of the crop when it comes to micro uh, cryptocurrency caps right so 
This is essentially why on my thumbnail, I actually identified these specific products, uh, these specific projects uh, that are extremely valuable. They've done, I've done a lot of research on these projects and these will have the potential to earn you some massive gain. So go back to that thumbnail and check it out. All right, there's a, a list of some stellar projects on that thumbnail. So you're gonna have to do a little bit of homework. You're gonna have to go back, check that thumbnail out, look at these projects. All right, I'm gonna drop them in the description. So the projects that are on the thumbnail will be in the description so you don't have to do too much work. Actually, I'll just save you the time. I'm gonna drop all the cryptocurrency projects that are in the thumbnail that have massive potential and I'm gonna identify where I think um, these projects could go in the next coming bull run, guys. All I'm trying to do is prepare you how is to prepare you for this up and coming bull run. Not only that, I wanna be able to give you the tools to be able to make these decisions and you could get all these tools in my patreon guys the link is in the description check it out there's tons and tons of information that i'm going to be uploading to this patreon to make sure that you get the maximum value out of this uh patreon guys and i labeled it as the 10x crypto mindset so what i'm wanting what i'm trying to do is accomplish is to give you guys that much value where you could actually come back to the the patreon and and share some wins and tell me hey you know i'm already making more than what i'm paying for them to be in this patreon and that's what my ultimate end game is is to give you guys that type of value to make sure that you're winning constantly doing the best that you can when investing in a cryptocurrency project i hope you guys got something out of this make sure you guys hit that like button make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and as always this is not financial advice take care be blessed i'll see you on the next video